it's all the time a pleasure for, for everybody in the company who worked uh, for many hours in developing new products, uh, new solutions and new innovations and showing them the first time. Uh, it's, it's like a, a child is born, let's say. Yeah? Everybody is happy and smiling all the day. Here at Amazon at the launch of the Agritechnica 2025 uh, International Press Conference. Thanks to Christian for inviting us over to Amazon to see the latest innovations. So now I'm just going to hand you over to Christian who's going to give you a brief overview of all the new launches from Amazon. My name is Christian Gall, I'm Head of Export at Amazone and also um, country responsible for, uh, for Ireland. So one of the biggest machines is directly behind me. That's really the biggest and most impressive machine we have, sh we have seen today. It's the Pantera 7004, um, where we presented several new features. One is the white track that we can offer uh, as a W version. And one small detail behind the cap is the direct inject si system that we also offer for Pantera right now. My name is Jens Mattes Freer. I'm with Amazone for three years now and I am in the product marketing for crop protection technology, especially for our self-propelled machines Pantera. So um, this machine, first of all, uh, Pantera 7004, nominal tank volume 6,600 liter, maximum 7,000. Um, yeah, of course, a big tank, tank volume gives, uh, gives us yeah, much efficiency in the crop protection. Uh, and yeah, one of the biggest features is that even if we have such a big tank volume, the machine is very compact, first of all. So it's less than 10 meters long and due to this also very maneuverable. We have, of course, all wheel steering and an inner turning radius of only four and a half meter. And when we think about the running gear, this is also yeah, probably one of the biggest features of this sprayer. We have a hydraulic running gear with a, a hydraulic adaptable suspension. That means the uh, running gear adjust itself as it um, yeah, takes all the data like the speed, uh, like acceleration, tank volume and so on and then automatically adjusts the pressure and the bumpers so that we always have the same driving behavior, doesn't matter if the tank is full or not or how fast we go or not. And uh, we always have a track width adjustment, especially interesting for uh, contractors. So with a wide range of yeah, 2 to 7.5 meter or uh, as I introduced today, W version two and a half to three meters. Yeah, so this is always a standard. And one nice feature of this running gear as well is our slope compensation. We have automatic slope, slope compensation as standard on this machine. This means we have a sensor uh, inside that measures uh, the angle of the machine. And when you go on a slope, it automatically adjusts it or levels itself back. This is done by our bumpers. So, um, our usual suspension dump bumpers are a little bit longer than they would need to be for only for the suspension, but we use this also for the slope compensation. Um, the slope compensation goes yeah, not in the driving direction, but in the side direction, because this is the most important thing, um, as we do not want to tip over to the side. And uh, yeah, this is one big feature here. And also especially for, uh, for um, the hilly conditions is that we have a very big gear reduction of 1 to 30.5 inside, which gives us a lot of torque with our uh, wheel motors and the uh, low gear reduction. So we are very powerful, even, even on uh, yeah, very hilly lands. And of course, for the slope, it's also important that the machine is not too heavy. Um, this sprayer, for such a big tank volume, only has a tear weight of, depending on the equipment, of course, roughly 12 up to 12 and a half tons which is quite a low tear weight for such a big machine. With the new uh, Pantera model 7004 that we introduced on the last Agritechnica, we also introduced a new cabin. Uh, the cabin is a, a class cabin, which is the latest version of it, with, which is, of course, in comparison to the older model, much quieter and much more space inside. But um, also new is now that we introduced our own armrest. Before, we used the armrest from class, which surely was designed for uh, uh, forage shoppers, for, for harvesters and everything where you need a lot of buttons. And 
Here we designed our own armrest. Um, the reason for it is it's much com more comfortable and it's much clearer. As with our uh, operation concept, you really don't need a lot of keys. As you do pretty much everything over your joystick, which is your driving joystick, but at the same time, you can uh, control nearly everything with this joystick. As it's an Isobus joystick, so you can configure it, every single button on it in three layers. So in the end, you can say, beside uh, things like uh, typing in your application rate, you really never need to touch anywhere else than on the joystick. So it's very comfortable to just leave your joystick in the hand and do everything with the joystick. And this is why we, we uh, developed our own uh, armrest here, because it's much clearer, much better overview, and yeah, much more ergonomic in the end. So we have this L3 boom generation, starting at 36 meters and going up to 48 meters. Of course, this machine is folded out now, but uh, when you see the machine folded in, uh, through this uh, all in all four parts here with all the booms that are bigger than 39 meter, it folds very compact. It still folds behind the cap here, uh, which by the way also gives us the advantage that the cap is very high, um, which is good for the overview because we do not need the space above the cabin for folding in the boom. You fold the boom very quick through our flex folding. It's an electro-hydraulic flex folding, meaning um, when the outer section starts, the next already starts to fold in and the same at the outside. So even if you have to go from yeah, one small field to the next and to the next, you have a lot of changes in fields. Um, the sprayer yeah, is very suitable for this as well as he uh, yeah, goes from street mode to field mode and the opposite very, very fast here. Uh, I, th I think that there's a use case in nearly every market because uh, every farmer uh, all over the world have, have the same problems that weeds are often uh, appear on nests and are not spl split over the, the field. And if you just can put the chemical where it's needed and the right spots where it's needed, I think it's a use case that we can find all over the world. Hello, my name is Hannes Meyer and we are in Altmohausen from the press conference and I'm from the product marketing Plows and I'm happy to show you our new Plow, the Terrace 200 models. Plows with four or five furrows for tractor class up to 200 horsepower. And here we have our very own machine with hydraulic working with adjustment. And on my right hand side, we have the step plow with mechanical working with adjustment. Our most important highlight of the plow is our parallelogram adjustment center. So we have here in front of the plow a parallelogram and in the middle we have on our vario plow our standard hydraulic front furrow adjustment cylinder here. So we can change the front furrow while working and that thanks to the parallel movement of the plow we can do it without changing the pulling point. So every time a perfect front furrow and the perfect pulling line for the plow. On the outer side we have as well our frame swivel cylinder for the plow. So on this cylinder swivels the whole plow to the side on the headland to get enough space for turning. So you don't need to change the working width anymore while turning, you swivel the whole plow to the side. The next big advantage are our wheels. We have optional wheels for the back of the plow or like we have it here on the side of the plow. Different options mechanically or like we have it here in the hydraulic way. The hydraulic wheel is more comfortable so you can change the working depth while plowing and the mechanical one is a bit more cheaper and more simple. The next very important highlight on our plows are the plow bodies. The biggest advantage of our plow bodies are the front section of our moldboard. These parts are very big and this has the advantage that when we plow with higher speeds the wear point is still here on the front part of the plow body. This means in the first time you don't need to change the very expensive mold board. You can change only the front part, which is less expensive and not so much work. All in all, we have seven different plow bodies for all different uh, type of soils. The big difference of uh, the slatted body comparable to the full mold board body are that we have a better crumbling effect with these slats here. Here in front of the plow, I'm standing in next to our headstock. We have here different coupling points for the top link. It depends on the size of the tractor and the, the, point, the coupling point for the lower links. And as well, we have here our smart center, the host cabinet 
for the hydraulic hoses if we decouple the plow from the tractor. To set up the plow right, we have here as well our spindles for the angle of the plow because it's always important that the plow is in a 90 degree angle to the unplowed area and with these spindles we can set up the right angle for the plow. Hello everyone, my name is Julian Krone. I am the product specialist for Pesto Soil Tillage at Amazon and we are here at our press conference and I would like to introduce you today our senior 5 meter. So the 5 meter, as we see currently, the tractor sizes are growing uh, on the farm. The farm sizes are growing, but the field sizes, they stay, stay like they are. So um, the farmers, they have to cover more hectares per day in small field sizes quite often. And there we need a machine that is really flexible and really fast in the corners on the headlands. And also we are folding, so when we have to swap between the fields. And for that, we have here our 5 meter Senio. So it's a three point mounted machine. With the three bar of tines, we can work about 5 to 30 centimeters with that machine. We have here uh, two different uh, overload safeties. So here we can see our spring overload um, with 500 kgs of um, release force. But we also can get it with the shear bolt if we want to. The machine is coming standard with a hydraulic depth adjustment and standard with our well-known leveling or uh, level control. With level control, that's a nice thing. When we start to change our working depths, our level control is always coming up and down in the same time. So that means we get always a perfect level field without getting out of the tractor cabin. So we don't have to adjust anything here. And that's really, really quick and fast, especially if we have different soil conditions. And then here in the back, we have our new spring roller. And with the new spring roller, we have a roller that is made for light soil types, like we can see it here. He runs pretty well in these kind of soil, but he also does a good reconsolidation in the deep because of the wide wings. And um, he does also good crumbling because he always takes a little bit of soil with him so that we get a nice covered field. It's pretty versatile um, because we um, can change pretty quick our uh, different uh, tines if we want to go uh, deeper, we can go to the 40 millimeter uh, share if we want to. If we want to uh, break more uh, the soil, we can go up to our 80 millimeter ones. And also for the for the roller, uh, depends on the soil conditions. Uh, we only we not only offer the spring roller, we also have our KWM roller. If you have, for example, more clay soil or a more loamy soil, and you want to get a really good reconsolidation, good crumbling. Um, there, for example, the KWM, so our rubber roller is also really versatile and also possible for that kind of cultivator. Yeah, so if you are interested in that kind of machine, just get in contact with your dealer. Um, we are really happy to uh, show that machine on your farm in your condition so that you get a really good idea of that machine, how it works, how it uh, crumbles your soil, how it loses the compactions. And uh, yeah, for that, it's made for your conditions. Hello, my name is Johannes Herold. I'm here at Amazona responsible for the product marketing of the fertilizing spreaders. And today I present you our new ZATS-01 with Autospread. What does it mean? Autospread is the first autonomous solution for a complete automatic adjustment of the spreader. And now we have a look in detail how it works. So how does Autospread work? Autospread monitors the real spread pattern in the field. And that we can realize by measuring for the first time the throwing direction, which we already know. And now, yeah, completely new for the very first time with these new senders, the throwing distance to the back. So when we have a look at this picture down here I've brought with me, we can now see the white area is the throwing direction and the red area the throwing distance. And these two parameters are completely the same parameters as we have in our spreading center, in our spreader laboratory, and that's the parameters we need. And with these two parameters, as you can see here, we measure, as I mentioned at the beginning, the real spread pattern, and then we automatically adjust the spreader to the perfect setting. Afterwards, when the machine is set it up, we validate the spread pattern. Because of our AMA Connect unit, we are synchronized with the digital twin of this machine, so we have the complete database from Amazona on the machine and then we validate the settings and we can monitor the driver in the cab, the distribution. We can warn against broken or worn spreading vans, 
So at the end of the day, when the spreader tells you the distribution is good, then the distribution is good and you can keep spreading. That was the auto spread feature, but together with the facelift, it's not only an optical facelift, there are a lot of new, a lot of new features here inside of the machine with the ZATS-01. We have a complete new own developed in-house software required to the needs of the farmers. With that new software, we now proudly present Curve Control. We already presented two years ago at the Agritechnica and awarded with a silver medal. This is now inside. And how does it work? In general, we have the problem while spreading that because of the distance of the spread pattern in the turning process, we spread fertilizer outside the boundary and we have an underdose zone here. And that is what we want to avoid. With curve control, we have now a sensor which measures the acceleration and the turning speed. And with that, we adjust the drop point and the rate shutter and the spread pattern follows the machine. Like you can compare it with a trail machine. And that is how it looks then and comparable to then. So we have no fertilizer over the border and not this underdose zone here, thanks curve control. Next to curve control, we can also offer a solution, a new solution for border spreading. So you just type into our software what you want to have. So your requirements for border spreading and then the software calculates the settings. So you don't have to type any settings on your own. The software calculates it for you. And together with that, we have now also integrated our known border TS deflector. In the past, it was hydraulic actuate and like a retrofit solution. And now it's completely integrated in the software with an electric actuator. So by a touch of a button in the software, he correctly documentates and works with this border TS deflector. Okay, when you are interested in this machine, keep contact to Farmhand and then we can arrange a demo and present it um, to you on your farm. Hello, my name is Axel Graner. I'm the product and export manager for the municipal technology at Amazone. I have the good information that we have extended our mower range by one additional machine. We start with our PH1250 mowers. They can mow and collect. Then we have our new entry model in the 1500 series, our Profi Mower 1500, and then our last version is available with cap and without cap, our Profi Hopper 1500. I would like to show you some details. We have a 1 meter and 50 mulching deck in front with 88 knives. You can choose in different versions. You may know from our uh, Profi Hoppers, so you have different seat options. You have a very, very good and comfortable armrest with all control items. You have a powerful engine with 45.5 horsepower. And what's new at this machine, we have a um, useful platform in behind with some lashing points to take different small tools or other obstacles for our operators with us. In behind, we have the possibility to attach uh, a, a trailer and um, this machine is also equipped with an all-wheel drive. If you're interested in one of our mowers, please get in contact to Farmhand in Ireland. They have all information of our Profi mower and Profi hopper range available for you. We're very excited to bring the Profi hopper to Ireland in 2026. So if you want any more information or to arrange a demo, please get in contact with Farmhand.